Let us have a discussion on Zener diode. Zener diode is basically like an ordinary PN junction diode, but normally operated in reverse biased condition. But ordinary PN junction diode connected in reverse biased condition is not used as Zener diode practically. A Zener diode is a specially designed, highly doped PN junction diode. Now we will come to the working principle of Zener diode. When a PN junction diode is reverse biased, the depletion layer becomes wider. If this reverse biased voltage across the diode is increased continually, the depletion layer becomes more and more wider. At the same time, there will be a constant reverse saturation current due to minority carriers. After certain reverse voltage across the junction, the minority carriers get sufficient kinetic energy due to strong electric field. Free electrons with sufficient kinetic energy collide with stationary ions of depletion layer and knock out more free electrons. These newly created electrons also get sufficient kinetic energy due to the same electric field and they create more free electrons by collision cumulatively. Due to this commutative phenomenon, very soon huge electrons will be created in the depletion layer and the entire diode will become conductive. This type of breakdown of depletion layer is known as avalanche breakdown, but this breakdown is not quite sharp. There is another type of breakdown in depletion layer which is sharper compared to avalanche breakdown, and this is called Zener breakdown. When a PN junction is diode is highly doped, the concentration of impurity atoms will be high in the crystal. This higher concentration of impurity atoms causes higher concentration of ions in the depletion layer. Hence, for same applied reverse biased voltage, the width of the depletion layer becomes thinner than that in normally doped diode. Due to this thinner depletion layer, Voltage gradient or electric field strength across the depletion layer is quite high. If the reverse voltage continues to increase after a certain applied voltage, the electric field strength across PN junction becomes so strong that the electrons from parent impurity ions come out and make the depletion layer conductive. 
This breakdown is called Zener breakdown. The voltage at which this breakdown occurs is called Zener voltage. If the applied refers voltage across a diode is more than the Zener voltage, the diode provides a conductive path to the current through it. Hence, there is no chance of further avalanche breakdown in it. Zener breakdown is much, much sharper than an avalanche breakdown. When a Zener diode is connected across a voltage source and the source voltage is more than the Zener voltage, the voltage across a Zener diode remains fixed, irrespective of the source voltage. Although at that condition, current through the diode can be of any value depending on the load connected with the diode. That is why Zener diode is mainly used for controlling voltage in different circuits. Theoretically, Zener breakdown occurs at lower voltage level than avalanche breakdown in a diode, which is specially doped for Zener breakdown. The Zener voltage of diode can be adjusted during manufacturing with the help of required and proper doping. This is how a Zener diode works. And also we come to know why a reversed biased normal diode cannot be suitably used as Zener diode and why Zener diodes are specially doped diodes. Thank you.